Your time right now is 5.07, and this morning we share how homeless Hoosers are now finding some hope. Yeah, that's right. A woman who runs a local nonprofit is being honored for her efforts. In today's story, we learn more about her mission. Help people in our community who are struggling. Our mission is to connect people in need to people who care. Event Markey's nonprofit helps those with substance abuse, mental health disorders, food insecurity, and she was recently given an award from CHIP for her work helping the homeless. Uh, Eric Pointer joining us now in the studio to share more on her latest outreach. Eric, good morning. Good morning. So right now she's working on a project to spread the knowledge of how Narcan can help save lives. It's called Understand the Can, and they are raising awareness to help prevent overdose deaths. She says that a group is authorized by the state to give out Narcan and share how to use it. They do outreach on the third Sunday of every month where they can go out into the city parks and explain how it works. They've been doing this since April, and she says that they've heard from at least four people uh, then to tell them that it's worked helps them save a loved one. What we know is it's, it's going to happen, you know, and we don't push abstinence. People, people are going to do them at the end of the day. And we just want people to know that there's ways to reduce that harm um, that is death that could come. The impact is huge. Four may seem like a little number, but if you think about each individual, how many lives attached to them that are saved since they lived. Markey was recently given the Diamond Service Award from the Coalition for Homelessness Intervention and Prevention. Because of that, she got to go to a national conference where she got training on what others are doing to end homelessness across the country. And she says that she plans on implementing those new skills into the work that she's already doing. For more information on her work or her nonprofit, you can find a link on our website, cbs4indy.com links. Here in studio, Eric Pointer, CBS4 News.